what's going on my people my name is Samuel and if you're new here consider to subscribe to my youtube channel and to my returning viewers I'm so thankful for coming back to view my channel to view my vlogs it's amazing and welcome back to my to the family so today I just decided to go to this a beautiful beautiful amazing place called Michuki Park that's just named after the late a minister of environment Onlambo Michuki. I want to give you a little history about this place and show you um, um, among the activities that you can do here and how this place looks like. So stay tuned and consider to subscribe. So guys, the first thing that you notice when you get into Michuki Park is this this uh, event event ground that's just at the gate when you enter to Michuki Park under uh, this amazing amazing uh, billboard that guides you and tells you where you're supposed to head and uh, gives you the information that you can find here in Michuki memorial park so i'm just going to go walk down here and just show you some of the things that you can do here and they're amazing beautiful this place it has been maintained as perfect as you can imagine so i want to give you a little history of this place it was uh, before it became a memorial park it was just but a dump site that was that was congested with uh, waste from Nairobi and every place and it was a hub of gang and uh, and the street kids so the late Michuki decided just to take the owner and uh, renovate this place and make it beautiful as much as possible to guarantee the Nairobi dwellers and to give them the amazing amazing uh, relaxation that you can find in the Nairobi Central so in uh, 2008 the then minister of uh, the then prime minister decided to name this place Michuki Park and uh, due to uh, due to negligence it was uh, it became it returned to be a dump site and uh, 2020 uh, the minister of environment and housing decided just to take the challenge the then uh, kiriako tobiko and uh, renovate this place in conjunction with the uh, nms carefree and uh, kenya forest service and to renovate this place so this you can see how this place looks like this place looks amazing amazing and uh, i want to take you through and show you some of the things that you will find here and the activities that you can do here you can see this part how it looks like it looks amazing and uh, they have uh, put uh, garbage uh, garbage containers around here so that whenever you come here if you are eating a snack or you're doing something you'll have to throw it into the this trash can so that you can maintain this place as you found it you can see how this bridge looks like I want to go down here and show you there's a liver that flows here it's just the Nairobi liver and there is a camp here I don't know if the uh, office service officers reside over here it's just but a quiet place where you can come and relax enjoy your day maybe meditate and uh, even read if you have a book like this guy over here someone is reading his own book I don't know what it's called it's a relaxation and amazing place to relax you can see the environment okay the thing that I just noticed that it's not uh, it didn't amaze me is this liver is now the water is not clean I don't know what the reason behind that but maybe it's because the human uh, activities that's making this place not to look as amazing as possible so A 
I'm just going to show you how this bridge looks like from down below here. This is how this the crossing bridge looks like when you're down uh, or you're just at down at the river. It's just but amazing, so chill, so quiet. If you don't want to go to the streets of Nairobi and um, escape the craziness and the chaotic things about the Nairobi, you can see this is the bridge that you cross over to the other side and uh, that's how it looks like from below here. You can see I'm so grateful for General Mi for Michuki to take the the initiative of innovating this place and making it a favorable place whereby you can chill and relax. You can see there are benches, wooden benches where you can sit down and uh, chill. So guys, you can see here there is a, a medical plant garden. Let me show you this, how this, they have done this uh, board. So, the medi, medicinal plant garden. So, I don't know what kind of medicinal plants are here, but let me just check one and see how one looks like. Huh, let me see the name of this medical plant looks like I don't know uh, it's a botanical name uh, African indigenous family losses common name as red stink wood uh-huh it's used to cure used to cure stomach ache woods dressing appetite booster and septic oh my god you yeah. it's amazing how uh, African uh, indigenous plant are used to do some amazing amazing work this is the medicinal plant garden looks like and the path looks awesome looks amazing if you are tired with the hassles and bustles of the Nairobi city and the chaotic streets of Nairobi why don't you give it a try and come over here and just relax and uh, enjoy your day and by the way and by the way if you didn't know coming here to Michuki Park is free entrance is free I literally didn't pay anything to come over here so give it a try come over here visit relax enjoy and uh, appreciate the nature as you can see how the benches have been aligned you see these are bamboo sticks, bamboo, bamboo stick. This is so amazing. I always heard about the Michuki Park, Michuki Park. I've never come over here to visit and today I decided to give it a shot and come over here and visit this place. And it's filled with the indigenous and indigenous plantations around here. You can see. It's so quiet, so chill, so relaxing. So just give it a try and come over here one of these fine days and enjoy.
there is this uh, small path and uh, this path leads you to the down to the river whereby you can see this river at a close range and uh, oh okay let me go here and see there is a I don't know what the there is a tent house around here so I don't know who lives in this tent house or maybe it's a camping the camping site I'm not sure unless I act stupid and ask people what's the reason for this tent house place whereby people sit and uh, relax and enjoy so there's so many benches around here I think maybe when you're having a conference or maybe you're having a meeting you can hire this place and uh, do your meeting you can see the benches looks amazing and uh, This is the another side of Michuki Park, just almost near to the road, and uh, you can see the Kenya Forest Service have really done a very great job to give the Nairobi city dwellers a saline place to relax, chill, and uh, have it all for the sake of uh, relaxing and uh, learning away from the chaotic city, Nairobi. I never imagined this place looks like this until I came over here and uh, experienced this lane and chill and quiet place to have your day. I don't know what this but they have something uh, they have written an entry oh okay mm -hmm. let me see an open air amphitheater I don't know what's the use of this but unless I go down there and uh, check what's the meaning of this an open amphitheater you can showcase some uh, talents and around here this is the podium whereby whoever is holding a meeting stands and uh, the audience sits up there and you listen to every each and everything the meeting holder 
has to say maybe sometimes maybe politicians might decide to have an open air meeting around here just to invite a few delegates to their meeting okay this was a very thoughtful idea of turning this place to be a nice a nice a nice place to relax chill and enjoy if you have a date and you just want to have to go to stroll the street of nairobi so don't be worried just come over here it's an open air place relax and enjoy you no one will ask you you enjoy your day have it all and uh, that's all